Hi, it's Pamela. In this tutorial, we're going to go over how to add Doodly videos to an email message. Hey, and welcome to the official Doodly YouTube channel. If you enjoy our content, please click the like and subscribe button below. Now let's get straight to the video. Earlier, we talked about how to create a thank you video for email using Doodly whiteboard animation software. But how do you actually get the video into the email? As you may or may not know, sharing videos via email is tricky because the files become quite large and they might be blocked by your email providers, either yours on your end or your recipients on their end. Even if they go through, it can take a long time to do so due to their file sizes. So we need a workaround. The first thing you will need to do is to upload your video to the desired hosting service, whether it's YouTube, your website, Wistia, Boomly, or any other location. Do that and then copy the link. Next, depending on what services you use, you will need to paste that link into your email message. You'll see if I paste a YouTube link into my standard email client, all I get is the link itself, which is boring and it might not entice anyone to click on it and watch it. They might not even realize it's a video. However, if I use a service like MailChimp, it will likely fetch the thumbnail from YouTube, as you'll see here. Wouldn't you say that's a little bit more enticing than a plain link? Now, what if your email service doesn't automatically grab the thumbnail for you, like MailChimp just did with the YouTube link? Most will allow you to add a link to an image itself. Thus, you can grab your own screenshot of your video, add a play button overlay on top, and then use that instead. Once inside your email software, you can upload that image and then add the hyperlink to it. As you can see, there are a few steps you'll need to take in order to email a Doodly video to your clients. It's not overly difficult and most email software will accommodate adding a image and a link and some will even automatically fetch a thumbnail for you. And that's the basics. Thanks for watching.